Stud Muffin 1986 here. Welcome back to World of Tanks Blitz. I <laughs> was just thinking of something fun for another video to create, and I was just wondering um, what are the rarest tanks in World of Tanks Blitz? Now, I don't know. You guys may have already an idea of what some of them are. I kind of had an idea of maybe what some of them are. Um, and even some of them have become even more rare after update 5.5. Uh, turning a lot of tanks into collectibles <laughs> and people probably just selling them to get other premium tanks and some just becoming more rare than others. So um, let's dive in. Now, all this data, once again, is from my um, <laughs> old school reliable resource of blitzstars.com. Um, so based on just primarily the data given here, um, this is not something <laughs> I'm trying to compile and just create. So completely blitz stars. Um, pulling a lot of data here and it's sometimes just it's just kind of funny to just kind of play around just kind of see what stuff you can come up with and find but this is where I got and so just to give you guys hopefully some context I wanted to kind of find out like okay what whatever number of players there are that have these kind of tanks um, which that's what I'm basing it off of is the fewest amount of players that own a certain tank according to blitz stars uh, would be ranked as the most rare tanks in the game. Um, and I'm not sure <laughs> where I was really going with that, but, um, oh yes. And so, but to have kind of an understanding of like, well, how rare are they really have to kind of have an understanding of maybe a player base and so forth. So I just did some other research here. And what I had found is that, According to Wargaming, um, about, I think, a year ago, I just hooked this up, <laughs> it popped up on Google, but apparently over the entire time, over the five plus years it's been around, uh, there's over a hundred million players. Just absolutely crazy. That's just what it popped up. So I, to try to get maybe a more realistic uh, frame of reference here is... Um, you know, I went back to my old video that I made of, okay, how many players are actively on Blitz? And about on average, there's about nine or 10,000 players on Blitz a month. That has actually grown over time, but that is where it is now. So now let's dive in here and find out what, according to Blitz stars, are the rarest tanks. Um, the, the tanks that have the fewest amount of players owning them, going from uh, 10 down to the rarest one. Um, <laughs> some of these were kind of interesting. So number one was the Tier 6 Premium Churchill MK6, uh, which... Some of these is kind of funny because I, I I might have an idea of why these are more rare uh, than others or just let alone the, the top 10 rare tanks in the game um, <laughs> just based upon my own opinion. Um, this tank, the Churchill MK6, when this thing first came out, I don't even know. I think this thing has only come out maybe one or two times in the store, but I don't think that was really the real reason why this thing uh, – <laughs> <laughs> may only have so many players. There's only 450 players that own, according, once again, Blitz Stars, uh, that own this tank, about 450. And the tank, in my opinion, just looks ugly. <laughs> it's, it's just like, it's missing its right part, you know, over its track, uh, track cover. And I think, I, I don't know, it, like some like jagged antenna, I think. Um, I don't know if it still has it, but I don't know. It just, and it already, the turret doesn't already look like it had a lot of armor. I don't think there was really anything special about this thing. Um, and therefore, which, you know, you don't have anything special or maybe you have something that looks ugly. <laughs> You know, players are going to buy it. That's just how it works. Um, number nine was the uh, Reynold FTAC uh, with only 444 players. Uh, this was a tank, you know, back in the day. It wasn't the tech tree line, but it isn't anymore. They, they've taken it out. And there's, um, it's now a collectible 
I ended up selling it. I wouldn't be surprised if there was a ton of other players that ended up selling it. Just a lot of these collectibles that people probably didn't even play and then Wargaming was coming out with these other premiums and other tanks for gold and it just motivated them to probably get rid of them. But there was still a few here, it looks like, that still held on to it. Um, so number eight is the tier 10 T95 E6 with uh, 437 players. Um, this one, I can see why this one would actually be rare because this one has actually been a tough one to get. I think, you know, it came out originally in the Christmas event. It was in crates and nobody <laughs> likes those. And honestly, to me, this tank didn't really seem that desirable to get. So, um, it, you know, and maybe that was kind of the, the audience and what they were thinking too. This thing just had like... It was an E5 with way more weak spots. <laughs> you know, maybe it was more maneuverable. I don't necessarily know. I haven't really done a lot of research in this thing, but um, it just, I don't know. It didn't really stand out to me, and maybe that's another reason, but I can also see the crate reason too. Um, so 10, 9, 8, and number 7, uh, the Tier 2 Cruiser MK1 with only 415 players. Um, this one, I believe, was also in the original tech tree, and then after the changes to the collectibles and eliminating a lot of those lower tiers, another one that kind of fell behind, um, just like the Reynold FTAC, a lot of people just started uh, selling it, and there, you know, so there was some that ended up holding on to the thing. Um, so 10, 9, 8, 7, and then... Uh, six is the tier three FCM 36 pack uh, with only 388 players. Um, this one was, you know, a premium tank that has come out. I think it's now turned maybe into a collector. <laughs> I'm not 100% sure, but that's what it originally was. Just, you know, real low tier, kind of cheaper tank destroyer. And <laughs> I mean, this one was kind of one of those tanks. I mean, lower tiers, I don't really know how much of interest there really is um and purchasing lower tier tanks you know some more than others and to each their own but i know when this came out i'm like ah, like why like and i'm not really one to play lower tiers uh, myself i honestly don't really play anything below tiers you know six or seven really um 99 of my time <laughs> i'm playing the higher tiers um and so you know there was it's like why purchase this thing you know especially when there was the martyr and other you know tank destroyers uh, in the game so um that's that and then um we've got number five uh the the hafen um the anime tank um with 364 players a premium tank and honestly i mean yeah, I'm I'm not really a huge into the the fantasy tanks uh, a, a ton. I like more of the the realism behind the blitz, um, the real tanks in the game. That's just 100% personal preference. I know there's a ton of people that just love these things and you know what? Teach their own and that's great. It's kind of <laughs> it's fun to have sometimes the variety in the game. Um, but I don't know. I, maybe there was just not a lot of people uh, that you know that had the same you know, feel maybe there was a lot of people that had the same kind of mindset. And so there wasn't a lot of people that purchased this tank. But um, I don't know, honestly, how often this thing has really come into the store. I don't think I've seen it a ton, though. Um, number four was a tier, t a tier two LTVZ38 with 214 players. Um, this thing, <laughs> I don't... <laughs> don't really know what this thing is i don't know if i've seen it um some sort of tier two i believe it's a chinese tank and i mean yeah i mean that's that so 214 players um and then number three is the tier six tiger 131 with 211 players now this one i can completely see why this one would rank really high in one of the rarest tanks i think it's only come out once but that's not the reason this thing was like from a lot of the youtube videos i had watched i know medzi did a video on this and <laughs> there was just a lot of people advising people not to buy this tank it was like it was noted as the 
um, the Kuro, uh, Kuro Muro Mine, worse version. <laughs> it was like, why would you buy this? If you have the Kuro, they just stay with that because the Tiger 131 was just a worse version of it. Um, which I can completely understand why people wouldn't buy that. Number two, this one, honestly, I don't know. This one really surprises me because this was like the first release. When I saw this on Blitzstars, I was like, what? Really? Um, this was like the first auto reloading tank in the game. It came out, um, tier seven. Honestly, I was kind of on the fence about it. There were, I, I had my reasons for not purchasing it. Um, but it's the M4 FL10 with 173 players. Now, I don't necessarily know why or what that, you know, what that really is. Um, you know, why that would be the case. I think this Blitz Stars data, when I was looking at the top, it's inclusive within the amount of players within a, a certain like win rate and how many X amount of battles are included in this. So I don't know. Maybe there was just players that ended up purchasing this thing and just haven't really met the threshold of battles or what but i was really surprised to see this one uh up so high and then number one which <laughs> caught me by surprise a little bit but i guess in a way not really but yeah um and it's not like one that's really been out a ton so maybe i can kind of see i don't necessarily know but it's the v it's the tier eight vk 168.01 p uh german heavy premium tank and with only 134 players recorded in blitz stars and honestly <laughs> I, um you know tanks especially to newer players anything that's big that's labeled as a heavy tank may have a lot of armor um, could come across as like, oh, look at this thing's huge. It's going to be awesome. You know, got to purchase it. And I thought <laughs> there would have been way more in the game, way more battles with this thing. Um, but it's, uh, it's up there is number one, 134 players, uh, within the filtered, uh, uh, record of blitz stars. So let me know what your guys' thoughts are. If this kind of aligned with the, what you guys were thinking with some of the rarest tanks. Um, I know blitz stars according, you know, it wasn't like the cleanest way and <laughs> I, I didn't really know of any other way to really, um, you know, filter this down and clean it up a little bit more. Um, I know sometimes uh, when looking into this, it's not 100% accurate, but I just thought this would be kind of a for fun video to make. Once again, let me know what you guys think. Uh, you know, of these tanks, maybe your reasons or tanks um, uh, that you are surprised that aren't on here. Um, but yeah, so um, actually the one that comes to mind that I was really surprised that's not on the, this list, is the um otsu which that only came in the stores way back in the day so <laughs> i don't necessarily know this is just blitz stars data once again um don't forget to participate in the 600 subscriber tank giveaway that i'm doing right now uh just a couple videos ago that i did this it's going on right now going on till the 16th of uh, this month and um, until midnight is when it stops. Uh, so this month is September. This is Stud Muffin 1986. You guys stay cool and keep tanking.